hey guys welcome back to my channel you saw this look which is why you clicked on this video because you want to see what's going on how i got it and all that great stuff so stay tuned um we're just gonna hop right into this look um i actually created this look before um going out and i said back then that i was gonna do a video on it never really did but um, I'm going to prime my face with the e.l.f. Mineral Face Primer. I don't know if you can see that. So I'm going to start with my eyebrows. And I bought this pencil from Ulta. It's the Sweet and Shimmer Brow Duo. And I'm just going to use the tint side. I have to get used to talking in videos. I still think that it's very weird, but that's what some people have asked me to do. So I'm gonna talk in my videos. And I just start by kind of outlining my brow. Kinda, yeah, and then just going in and filling it in. I'm gonna take this Pro Concealer and the color, it's a yellow corrector, but I use it to conceal under my eye. Cause I don't want it to do it too much. And I'm just out. I'm gonna go in with this Jaclyn Hill palette. Let's see, it's reflective. There we go. By Morph. And these colors are super pigmented. Um, I'm gonna first go in with this color here. Go in with this color here. And this. I'm gonna go in with this color right here that's right next to me. This color seems to get right on that outer. We're gonna take Central Park and we're gonna focus. Now I'm gonna take this Pro Concealer here, the yellow corrector. I'm going to put that all over up to the crease of my eyelid. And this is going to come into play when you really want those colors to be super vibrant. Go back to that Jaclyn Hill palette. And I'm going to take this little angle brush and I'm going to Use the color, yeah, which is right here. Mix STFU and just pack it on. I'm now gonna go in with that fluff brush that we used earlier, and I'm going to go in the outer corner with this color here that black here just a little bit and pop it right there on that outer splitting it out and not up Covergirl Queen 3-in-1 foundation. That's amazing. And my color is Q815, which is the color brulee. that I created this look was just like a uh, oh let me try something different 
and then everybody liked it. So I was like, well, can you please recreate that look? And I'm like, I don't even remember. But I did. I hope that this is close to what y'all were wanting. Let's show you this Q-tip to get some of that black eyeshadow out the way. And I'm going to go in with that Pro Concealer and the Yellow Corrector under my eye. And again, I mentioned earlier, I don't know where my brush went that I used to set this found this uh, concealer specifically. So I'm gonna use my finger. Yes, I know that this is really light. My mom hates it. But I like it. LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Espresso. You are a I'm just gonna go in with this black eyeliner on my dog. Now I'm going to go in with these lashes by The Charm by Garland that you get from the hair store. Um, in the number 523, if I can get this open. And I'll just put it in the middle of I'm gonna go under those lashes, like I don't know if you can see, like where my lashes are, like in there on both. And I'm just gonna take this volume and extension waterproof mascara, like this. I'm sure you can buy it at Walgreens or your local beauty supply online. It's not expensive. Just gonna go on top of that with just some juicy lip strawberry. Just some lip gloss. It says RT um 30. It's just a brush that I use specifically for highlighting. And I'm gonna use the e.l.f. highlighter um, in the color Moonlight Pearl. All right. And this is the completed look. Tell me guys what you think. Mm-hmm. <laughs>